Welcome back to North of the Broad. Kevin Phillips is with us now. He is a town councilman in Port Royal. So it's good to see you and thank you for your service in the in the town. But you're here to talk specifically about this, finally, the <laughs> July 4th event that had to be canceled last year because of COVID. Right. Yes, ma'am. We're all uh, very excited about it. As you mentioned, yeah. you know, last year was, um, you know, a very trying time for everybody. Right. So we're excited to um, open everything back up. Um, July 4th will be held on, on that, that Sunday. Sunday. Absolutely. Right. Um, it, it's going to be a great event. We, um, the, the, the Sands Beach will be open. Mm -hmm. um, the, there will be no driving down um, Sands Beach Road. So that's something right. to keep in mind if you okay. are coming down there. Okay. Um, however, there will be parking available throughout the town directions there'll be signs up it'll be you know pretty obvious which which way to go and, and what to do um the town we are not allowing any coolers down there though but however on the beach we will have uh two sponsors down there the the boy scouts of america right. and the um historic port royal foundation will be down there and they will be providing um, food and and drinks um you know okay. children and adult friendly drinks right. down there so, um, Kevin, what kind of entertainment can we expect at okay. Port Royal? So, there will be two stages going on. Uh, right. If you haven't been down there in a while, there's a community beer garden, which is um, right. right in the area where the, um, the boat ramp is. Right. It's pretty obvious when you get down there, you can see it. So, the beer garden will be having live music starting at 1 o'clock. Mm -hmm. And also, right around... Um, the way, you know, just a couple hundred yards away, right next to the large concrete building, there's an open field that's going to be um, turned into a kind of a concert hall as well. We've, okay. we've used it for festivals in the past. Um, this event is actually be, being run by the, the gentlemen that, run, that own the, uh, the port. So okay. that's a, a private event. So there will be two stages going. We'll have our little stage going on yeah. at um, the beer garden and then the main stage mm -hmm. going on in the, the large uh, field over there. Um, Music starts at 1, um, okay, goes perfect. until 8 p.m. The, the big bands that we have coming in, um, so Zach Deputy, okay. as well as uh, Driving and Crying. So, I mean, it's a, a, a pretty known band. Pretty, yeah, yeah, pretty absolutely. fantastic to come to Port Royal. Absolutely. I'm not going to say Little Port Royal. I'm going to yeah. say Port Royal. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so they'll be playing on the, the main stage over there. Okay. These concerts are free. They, okay. I know that the um, I've spoken with the owners of the port. They will pr be providing parking on their property. They will charge for the parking. But, and I believe it's $10 a vehicle okay. for parking, but there's no fee for tickets to the event nice. or anything like that. Nice. So that'll be open, completely open to the public. Um, I would recommend, you know, kind of getting there early. Sure. And so um, that'll be going from one o'clock until eight. Mm -hmm. They will also have, um, I think about five or six food trucks okay. out there as well too. So there'll be plenty of um, opportunities yeah. to get something to eat, something to drink, and there'll be music going on all day. And then of course that Absolutely. night. Yes. So, fireworks exactly finally <laughs> fireworks and and we've got a uh, something special planned so since we had last year canceled you know and we budget for the fireworks every year the town pays for the fireworks they're actually shot off of a barge out in uh, battery creek um so it's they do a, a a good show if you've been in the past they do an amazing show so since we didn't spend any money last year we kind of doubled up on this year so our goal was just to have the best fireworks show in um in beaufort county so we'll see if we can do that <laughs> I, uh, I think we will. So. You'll have a lot of competition. Yes. Yeah, so, hey, well, we, we, somebody's got to have the biggest, so, you know, why not Port Royal? So you're, of course, town councilman, but mm -hmm. is there a, a huge planning in, involved in an event like this? Do you have a big committee or who really is in volunteer, a lot of volunteers working? Yes, yeah. ma'am. A lot of volunteers. So the, the volunteers that are going to be provided are the Boy Scouts. Right. The um, Port Royal, his, the Historic Foundation is providing, um, and then also our local police are, okay. are ready. I mean. The, the, this, we've done this event every year. It's just interesting now because we canceled last year. So now it's just kind of, we're back. But I mean, we've, we've done this before. So we've worked out the, you know, we've had logistics and people that are, you know, have, that know how to handle the situation. So we, we have been planning a lot of volunteers. A lot of people are going to put a lot of, oh. you know, energy and, and sweat into it. But oh, it'll it's, be, it's, it's, it's going to be completely worth it. It's going to be so fun. And yeah. again, we're back. Exactly. It's that, you know, I think we'll appreciate events like this so much more, don't you? Oh, yeah. People would just enjoy it as a family-friendly event, again, on July 4th in Port Royal at Sands Beach. Yes, right? ma'am, at Sands Beach. Um, the beach will be open all day. The um, music and the concerts start around 1. Okay, perfect. And if you don't know, Kevin is with uh, Schiller & Hamilton Law Firm. Yes. So we talked with your... Um, with with uh, Bennett earlier. So. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> your boss. He's a great boss. Great, um, 
Great guy to work for, um, really kind of instills in us and all the attorneys just the importance of you know community service and, Very good. and being involved in, in giving back to the community. We, we love this area and um, we try to spend as much time as we can giving back and, and helping out any way that we can. Thanks, Kevin. Yeah. Thank you for being with us today yeah. and we'll be right back with North of the Broad. Stay with us. Thank you.